Hi, my name is Trevor with Embers Fireplaces and Outdoor Living. Today what we're going to talk a little bit about is the difference between a catalytic uh, combustor stove and a non-catalytic stove and what are the advantages between the two. Some stoves that use a catalytic combustor, the catalytic combustor is going to look something like this. In both models, this is going to be a reburn system, an example of one. Both ways are efficient ways to heat. They both allow the stoves to be EPA certified and uh, achieve desired efficiencies. But some people say that a catalytic combustor is too much maintenance, too much work, and so a reburn system is a better way to go. What are the pros and cons to each model? Well, let's start with the catalytic combustor. So the way a catalytic combustor works is there's precious metals in this honeycomb style here. And what happens is once they get hot enough, it creates a chemical reaction which can turn the smoke uh, into a form of heat. And so that's what allows it to be efficient. So it's a little more scientific uh, than a, a reburn stove. But basically that's why we have a damper bypass is because we want this away from the, the heat and low temperatures because the temperatures are too low to create a chemical reaction to allow the system to reburn. So that's why when we exceed temperatures over 500 degrees, we're gonna put our bypass away and now our catalytic combustor can go into effect. So it is a little more maintenance because we gotta watch the temperature of our stove and then there's a little bit of work to do. We're gonna have to move a handle once we reach 500 degrees. So some people don't wanna deal with that maintenance at all. So they'll do a reburn stove. The way something like this works, it's gonna sit above your firebox and your flames are going to come up here and instead of ex exiting right up out your flue it's going to hit this and this thing is pumping extra oxygen in and so that extra oxygen works as fuel for the fire and that will reburn several times before going around and escaping up your flue. So both models are effective. What you're going to see as far as the differences between the two is the catalytic combustor we're going to think of this more as a marathon. Our reburn system we're going to talk about more as a sprint. So because this reburn system is pumping extra oxygen into the firebox, it is getting hotter faster. And it's basically creating almost like a second fire. So you ha basically can have two or three fires going at once. You have your main fire and then a fire up above, which is creating hotter temperatures. And although it is just as efficient because it's burning through as much as the soot and wood as possible, it's doing it much faster and getting hotter in a faster period of time, which is gonna result in seven to nine hour burn times. A catalytic combustor is gonna be more slow and steady. And some would say slow and steady wins the race. So this can, you can have even temperatures of six, 700, sometimes 800 degrees for 30 hours in a burn cycle because of this chemical reaction created in this. So over a longer period of time, a catalytic stove is going to heat more efficient because it can reburn for longer periods without you having to reload wood as long. But the trade-off is, is you do have to activate the damper and make sure you're staying above 500 degrees. And then also, they, these could be more maintenance over time because what happens is the, the, these honeycomb things have precious metals on them. So if they gunk up or soot up, um, if you're, especially if you're burning glossy newspapers or, or soft wood, that can create a problem and cause this to be ineffective. And because it has precious metals, this can be expensive to replace three, $400. But if you do your maintenance properly, this is not something you're gonna have to replace. Sometimes people will get in there and scrub them clean. Well, what they're doing is they're scrubbing off the precious metals, making this ineffective and useless. So it does require a little more attention, a little more attention to detail, a little more care, but it is in the long run a better way to heat because it's going to burn your wood for longer periods of time. So hopefully that reduces some of the confusion and we offer stoves that use both technologies. We even offer stoves that use a combination of the two, a hybrid stoves where they're going to use a reburn system combined with a catalytic combustor. That's also a great way to go. So if you have any questions you can call our text or staff at 805-952-5440 or check out these products on our website at www.blazingembers.com. Thanks a lot for checking out this video.